Hi, my name is Deline Honey and in today's video we are going to play Ooblets on my Nintendo Switch. So let's start. I need to say that I'm not going to start a new game from scratch, but I'm continuing my already existing save game. I'm not very far, so I've just started and I I've got already a little farm, but honestly I've only played a few hours, so there is not a lot existing until now. Normally when I'm playing Ooblets, I'm just playing that because it's some kind of cozy, comfy game. So I'm not really playing it with a special goal. I'm sometimes just farming and relaxing and calming down. So I hope you will enjoy that too. the volume of the music because I already recognized with Zelda that you will have problems to understand me then if it's 100% and in Zelda there was no possibility to decrease that but here we have it so I'm stuck I never saw that option <laughs> cool so we are loading my existing game. Yeah, Liftrasil, as you might already know, is my original nickname. So I'm normally using that for my save games or for my characters as name. Um, Ooblets is, I hope I pronounced it correctly, Ooblets is a combination of farming like Animal Crossing and Pokemon. So you own a little farm. I just go there to show you. So here's my here's my little farmhouse. Now I need to see where I can hide that so I can see a little bit more. So that's my little farmhouse. Which you can uh, decorate, repaint, so you can uh, change what things are in here, how the walls are painted and how the floor is looking and all that. Like an Animal Crossing, you can change the house as well. How it's painted, how big it is and everything. You need to buy these things, they are not for free. And this area is my farm, which I got for free so the farmhouse and the little farm here you get for free at the beginning and my farmhouse is already upgraded at the beginning it's just some kind of destroyed wooden house and i've already upgraded it and this is my little farm so you see the i mean it's night so on the right top you see the daytime and here it's night so that's why it's so dark so here these are plants and if there is some glitter flying around the plant is already ready to harvest like here for example but not not that i didn't want to <laughs> enter that maybe i'll show that later so this for example come on not enter, I want the plant. Okay. Can't. So maybe because. Maybe because it's. F ah. It's not played it for a long time, so I need to enter farming mode. So you can see in farming mode, you can see how many days this still has. So this has n zero days, therefore it's ready to harvest, for example. So I can. Something? No. That's just the ooblet. Okay. The rest is not ready. And then you will uh, see next to the days, you see how 
uh, how many water it has. So if it's red and you need to water it, you can also water it earlier, but I'm normally not doing that. I think that's also too hard. Uh, this, for example, needs water. So, how's that working again? Uh, I need to put that here and select the can. Yep. Now, I need to water that. And you can also see that the earth, for example, here is darker than here, so everything that has uh, light earth needs to be water. Uh, then you need to refill your... How is that called in English? Drizzle dripper. Can. So the can needs to be refilled. And we've done that now, so it's already getting light. And it's not day, I think. Is it already morning? No, not sure. So we are watering them before they are dying. I've not. I, I need to say I've not played for a long time now. I just played at the beginning after I bought it. So, next thing. Where, why are the houses in between? So every time in the middle there is a little house. This house is my Ublet Coop, I think it's called. And this is a little house where my Ublets are uh, living. Um, Ublets are, like I said, little some kind of little Pokemon. Uh, you're not collecting them by uh, throwing a pokeball on them, but in the town, for example, if they are standing around, then they tell you what you need, what ingredients you need to give them to be able to battle them, and then you battle them. Uh, a battle is... Uh, a, it's called a dance battle, but basically you are playing a card game. And every time a card is played, they are dancing. That's why they say it's a dance battle. But for you, it's a card game. And if you win, then the ooblet you've uh, you've beaten can give you a seed of itself. And this seed you need to plant on your farm. And if it's grown, you can take it, so you can harvest it. And then you have your own blood of this type. Um, and then this oop coop, or oop blood coop, I'm not sure how it's called. Wait, can I see that here? How it's called? Because my English is not the best, so oop coop it's called. Uh, these oop coops are for you because if you have a big farm, uh, the day is not very long, so you. You won't have the time to plant everything, to water everything, to harvest everything on time. And this is where your ooplets can help. If you build an oop coop, uh, you can put ooplets in there, depending on which grade this oop coop has. I think until now I can I can create oop coops up to level four, I think. I think here you can see it. I think until level three or four. At first level, you uh, you see you they can help you clear weeds, rocks, and twigs. On level two, you can also insert uh, an ooplet to water your crops. And on level three, you can insert an ooplet for harvesting and so on and so on. So next level is plant seeds, then warm crops. But for every level, you need your own. Ooplet, which is doing that work, and they are helping you the whole day. But every ooplet you have in placed in your oop coop, you have not with you, so they are not available for battles in the town. That's why you normally decide to 
to use the not very developed ones here. Until now I've not seen a reason why I should use an up-leveled ooplet oop here. So in this case I am normally letting them water and uh, clearing the weeds because that's getting on my nerves. Until now I do not have enough ooplets to uh, let them harvest. And I'm still not having oop coops everywhere. So why are they always in the middle? An oop coop is only able to uh, to process all the feeds which are surrounded. So every feed that is around directly around this oop coop is managed by them, and every field else not. So you can only manage these few. That's why there are a lot of oop coops. And for example here is one missing, so we will place it here. Place. I'm not sure if I'm having available plants for that. We will see. Select an oblet. So these are as, as it's shown, these are the babies which are following me. So level 6, level 3, level 4, level 5, and so on. And these are the home bodies. For example, this is a level 1. So I will use that because it's not leveled up. And I'm not missing that. And as it's also displayed, if you are using hoop coops, you get a bonus. So uh, it's growing, I think it's growing faster. and. Therefore, you get your things earlier. So we have one coop more for my farm. And if, as you can see, these red things here are the weeds. So they are destroying your plants normally. And you also have wood here. And this, for example, costs me energy, so 6 is the energy which costs me. And on the right top you see how it's decreasing. But I need to collect wood and other things to be able to build new hoops. So like in Animal Crossing, you are just collecting things and day by day you your amount of energy where you can, with which you can do things. I mean in Animal Crossing you don't, do not really have energy. Here you have energy and if it's uh, empty you either have to eat something or you need to go to bed and sleep. And then it depends on which time it is if you can just uh, take a nap. So it's just feeling a little bit of energy or if you need to sleep until the next day. Yeah, there are lots of things in stones normally. What I normally need, what is normally missing if I want to upgrade or build an oop coop is wait. Uh, upgrade. There you can see what you need. So cost is shown and the right thing which is dark at the moment is this how is it called subsidiant or something like that. So I'm normally missing that because they are very rare. You need to find them in the town, they are normally lying around, or you are destroying stones and find them, or you are gaining some points and you can buy them. So I need to show you that. So here you have these wishes, and with these wishes you can, for example, buy the missing clothes. Uh, gummy is uh, your money, and yeah, obsidian is called. With 100 wishes, you can also uh, buy an obsidian. Obsidians are very often uh, needed to build something. That's why I'm normally not being able to build something because this is missing. Yeah. 
So you've seen my little farm. Oh my god, this is all to harvest. Wait. I need to harvest that. And then I'll show you the farm. Oh, maybe I'll show you my cool machines also before. Because we are already on my farm. Pump dude. I'm not sure how to pronounce it. <laughs> For example, you can create floor, so you insert an oblet and then you can f create floor out of some ingredient, you, out of some plants you've already harvested. And then there is also a machine, a swooshler, where you can make juice out of things you've, you've harvested. That's really cool. That's my mate box, so I've got something. Thank you. Yeah, and as you see, these things which are following me are the babies, and one of them is uh, this this one which has the glitter around, so the ooblet left to me. This is some kind of special ooblet. I, I'm not sure how it's uh, called. It's shiny or, or... I'm not sure. It's a special one which also increases the chance to find obsidians. my town. I already s I already have access to two towns, so this town and the second one which I can uh, visit by a, by a balloon. So this is the shop where you can buy seeds. Uh, this is um, yeah here ca you can sell things a little for a better price than in the shop but the disadvantage is that you need to have more of them. So, for example, you have to you need to have fi 15 clove flats or 15 mass or 20 carrots to sell them. And in a shop, you can also buy. Uh, you can also sell one or two or three or something like that. But you can you're selling them at the uh, at. Uh, a worse price than here. So it's also important. These are the shops. For example, here you can buy furniture. Uh, yeah. Buy furniture. I've already upgraded this shop, so you, I can already buy more things than normally. And here you can uh, make your house bigger. And this is a machine where you can create some special things like for example little coop or uh, paths or sprinkler or something like that. But uh, for being able to, um, uh, to build these machines you first need to buy blueprints with wishes. Before you have the blue blueprint you can't do that. And as you can see here, there's an obsidian needed. Here's an obsidian needed. So I think for everything, an obsidian is needed. No, here yeah, not. Not, not for the rest. An obsidian is needed. <coughs> so this is normally the problem. I want to have this wallpaper. Oh, that's cool. Pink paint. That's cool. Uh, the paint is always for outside on your house. Um, yeah. In town you can, for example, shake trees and collect uh, the fruits. Or you can collect wood. You can collect wood, or you can go to the beach and collect shells and sell them. So, in my case, it seems like I already have. 
lot of things here. Uh, you can also find pieces of recipes to uh, cook yourself something to eat. You always need to have four pieces and four pieces are then uh, put together to one complete recipe. Uh, th these are ooplets you can for example uh, battle and here you see the dance demands are three of these four bets but I only have one of them so I can't battle them at the moment. We need to see if I can do something to be able to battle one so I can show you that. Uh, this is the reconstitute. Um, here you can, for example, put some... You normally uh, have these mystery cans lying all over this town and you collect them and put them in the reconstitute. And this reconstitute is then working on them and as baits you get these... Wait. These things. And with them you can go fishing. Wait, we are going fishing now. To show you that. If, uh, by going fishing you can also get an obsidian. And cast. you can only influence what you get by the quality of the bait you're using but there is not really uh, some kind of fishing technique or something you can use. not got anything special. I need to see a pole. And sometimes there on the beach there is something, I think it's golden, a golden shell lying around. This one is very expensive, so if you see that you need to collect it and sell it because you get a lot of money for it. No, my god. I want this mushroom because if we have three, there is the yep. there is another one. The mushrooms have told me that I need them for a battle, so we can now do a dance battle. <coughs> and as you, oh, as you can see, my character is already nearly sleeping. Oh my god, begin a dance battle. So, select your squad. Um, here you can see Fleebel is marked yellow, so if I win the battle, I can get the seed of Fleebel, but not of the rest. Play a card game. I don't know why it's this 
displayed like that on my TV. I'm not sure how it's done displayed on the video, but on my TV it's kind of cupped, so you don't see everything. Uh, on the left bottom you see the beats. I have five beats at the moment. This means uh, these beats are also on this card. For example, this uh, needs zero beats. This needs two, two, one, one. So I have five beats until I need until the other one uh, is playing. But I can also end the turn before. Um, in this case. <laughs> Hypes. Hypes are something to yeah to get more points than normally so you're stronger. As you can see I now earn more points than before. So I get more for my beats. And on the left side you see I I now have gained five points and I need forty to end. Uh, not to end, to win the game. Now I have 8 points and the other one has still 0 because it's not their turn, now it's their turn. And as you can see every time when the card is played they are doing some dance moves, that's why they call it a dance battle. Because we get a bonus for every card that's played. Also for the card which has zero points. I think I've done something wrong because I should have got the hypes before. for your deck. In this case not. Get a seed from the fleet. So I say yeah. And now he's giving me a seed. And then you need to plant it on your farm and water it. And you get a fleet. So you're not directly getting your animal but you're, you need to plant it before. What is funny because dumb bird, for example, is a bird, and you need you need to plant the bird. But okay, I mean that's game culture. My God, what can I do there? I want to have this spooky wallpaper, but I don't have. Candy. I think candy needs to be collected by the people. Hey, I'm a little. Oh, little. 
Collect candy in the houses? I'm not sure. I think you get an idea of this game, so it's quite a cozy game, like Animal Crossing is for calming down. You have no end boss situations or something like that, you're just collecting things and selling things and farming and exploring. Yeah, I need a nap, I have no energy anymore. Oh, I need to cook myself something. Also my poor pets are full. Uh, what I need to see is I still need for a task I still need a cheesecake which is normally lying around in this house. No, that's a cat. I need a cheesecake because I have no recipe for that. Uh, what I have hidden before are my tasks and I can also expand them so you as you can see the above ones are the daily wishes this is like an element crossing these uh, which are yeah on this day the difference uh, to animal crossing is in animal crossing if you fulfill them you get new ones and in this case you only have three per day and the tasks below are tasks by uh, people from the village which you need you need or uh, you should fulfill to get something and here in red is always written what is still missing so for example bean juice i don't do not have until now because i do not have a bean juice recipe and here uh, also a lot of thing is also a lot missing because I do not have the recipes carrot cake I do not have a recipe yep something like that so I'm not fulfilling them at the moment show you here's the balloon with this balloon you can fly into other towns as well there are a lot of towns available i think because the map is quite huge and i've only explored a small space here you have these dumb burbs here you can see some things i've already collected and put in because I'm tired but I think still can collect uh, candy why is she not talking to me that's some polite This is some kind of club. Mm, the loading time is a little bit annoying. Not, not really, I mean it's not so long. 
dream light battery is awful. It's, it has extremely long loading times. This one is... Yeah, I mean, it's annoying that it's always displaying that it's loading, but it's not very long as you can see. You just see it for a few seconds. Hello, sweetie. Yeah, get candy. Oh. And as you can see, I mean, it's it's not done as sweet as Animal Crossing. Ah, I always forget that I do not have energy. It's not as sweet as Animal Crossing, but um, it's quite sweet. It's very simple, but it's sweet. And I think they've done it in a very nice way. So it's also not buggy. I've not seen any bugs until now. Uh, in Dreamlight Valley, for example, I've experienced a lot of bugs, so it's, uh, in my case, it's uh, crashing a lot of times and it's not saving, what is annoying a lot. So I'm really upset about that because I've uh, bought myself the full, uh, how is it called, ultimate version, I think, so I think it's it's about 80 euros or something like that. It's not really cheap and I mean it's crashing extremely often and not saving and what is also not working is cloud saving. I mean in my case I'm, I've created my account and I also logged in what was working and then it saved uh, the first time I played the game and after that never again. So this is a real problem. Okay, can't get candy here. No one has candy for me. something we can change on Padoot we have 17 the loadings that's nice Thing I have, I mean, 624 gummies are cool, so I can buy myself the paint I wanted to have. How oh, much, much is that? 2000 oh my god. I never had so much money until now. Also go to the hairdresser and get in, get another hairdress, or you can buy yourself clothes or something like that. 
I can have it. Ah, yeah, this one I should buy myself. Oh, the idea now missing because I bought myself the paint. Wait. I need another backpack because that influences how many things I can carry around. So I will just sell something and buy myself the backpack. Oh, uh, this is for a worse price than normally, but it doesn't matter. So. Now we have enough. I'm not sure if you heard my daughter in the background. <laughs> She's in some client some kind of half sleep and she was making some noise <laughs> yeah I can buy myself a backpack so I've already reached some kind of goal Just automatically. Okay. Mm -hmm. Looks like clothing. So we've already reached some kind of goal for today. <laughs> That's cool, because normally I'm, as I said, just playing for fun. So I'm running around, collecting things, seeing what I can create, and that's it. Yeah. And I will also use my pink paint to show you how you can redesign your house. Before I'm going to sleep. Me and my character in the game. <laughs> so how was that working? Um I think furniture. And then decor. And then you can say cream teal. Oh that's cool. Okay. <laughs> uh dust. I had the cream paint before. Somehow this is cool, so I left this. I mean, it's a little bit too much uh, pink, but okay. Somehow it's funny. Yeah. I think for today we have seen enough. You have seen uh, the ooplets, the oop coops, uh, farming, watering, harvesting, everything, planting with planting. I've not shown you how to plant the seed. You, for example, put it. So the items above are the ones you, you can use for farming. Wait, now we enter the farming mode, then we select the label and then uh, we say plant. Do I have enough energy to water it? No, I don't think so. But it's managed by the Oku already, so it doesn't matter. So as you can see there is already one watering it. Yeah, so you've also seen how to plant them and Maybe in a future video I can show you how to harvest it, but I think for today we've seen enough. And therefore, I will go to my 
house. And we will say sleep until morning. I would say for today it's enough. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, share it. If you have any questions or comments for me, please tell me in the comment section below. If there is another game you're interested in, which I have on my Nintendo Switch or I might have on my Nintendo Switch, please also let me know in the comments below. I hope we see you in the next video. Have a nice time. Bye!